Welcome back, everybody. Today we are jumping back into Elden Ring. Uh, and if you recall last time, we were actually trying to fight the mini-boss that's up here. I don't know if he's actually technically a mini-boss, but that's what I'm going to call him, because that's kind of what he feels like. And he was absolutely butchering us. So I think we should probably level up a little bit more. And while we're actually leveling up, I want to... Um, there's something that I learned <laughs> that I might have been doing wrong. Uh, right over... where is it? Right over here. I uh, I could be wrong on this, but I want to say that the glowing yellow trees that I think I've come across a couple times, I think there's something at that glowing yellow tree that I should probably go pick up. So if I remember correctly, there's one right below here. Um, so if I have to fight these wolves again, so be it. These wolves aren't really that challenging. A little bit of extra... Uh, runes, XP, whatever you want to call it. Doesn't hurt. And then also I was thinking, you know, I want to go back to the beginning area. Like where I first started because there was a there was a statue there that had a stone sword key or, or required a stone sword key. And I didn't have one at the time and I have one now. So I want to go back there and see what's in that room. Hmm. Okay, maybe not. I thought that there was supposed to be something at this, but I could be wrong. Or maybe I picked it up and I didn't realize. But, uh, whatever. Alright, so, I want to go back to this place over here. And I forget what that one is called, so let's find that on the map. Is it this? Yeah. There was a, there was a room in the, in the place that I started in where... There was like fog, I didn't go through the fog, then right next to the fog there was also a statue that required a stone sword key. And um, I didn't go through the fog because I thought I could go through it later. Oh, right here. And I just never came back to it. And now also I have a stone sword key, so I want to see what this does. Use stone sword key. Hopefully it's not a waste right here, but we'll find out. Not enough? Okay, let me see if I actually have one because I'm pretty sure I picked one up and I don't think I've used it. So maybe it just requires more than what I have, because I could have sworn that I got a stone sword key. Okay, I do have a stone sword key, but apparently I can't use it on this, because it says not enough, so I'm not sure how many I need, but whatever. Can I, however, walk through this? No, I can't, okay. I wanted to check something else while we're in this area as well. I wanna see if there's anything in here that I, didn't get when we were here last time that I can possibly get now. Because it looks like, yeah, I can go down here maybe. And I have no clue it's down here, but it might be worth checking out. Okay. Uh, before I jump down there, though, is there anything over here? Uh, it doesn't really look like it. It looks like just a dead end. Is there anything over here? No, 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 no. Okay. Oh, wait, here's another one of the glowing trees. Okay, so is there anything at this glowing tree, or am I crazy? Nothing at the, at the tree, it seems like. Okay, maybe I'm wrong. All right, so let's go down here. Let's see what's down here. Maybe this will connect me to where that... Oh, is this like a tutorial area that I just never did? Maybe this will might possibly connect me to that... um the part where the the fog door is uh, let's go over here this just seems like a big drop okay no i'm fine i was just afraid of a uh, dropping and dying but it wasn't that bad of a drop i guess or not dying but getting hurt I'm trying to conserve my life sights of grace i think this was the, maybe the way i was supposed to go and i just never did lost grace discovered okay I thought I saw something moving. Oh, okay, I did see something moving over here. It's these guys, though. These guys don't really seem to do anything. They do have swords, though, so these ones actually do do something. They do do? <laughs> I'm doing a tutorial once I'm already, like, several hours into the game, which is kind of hilarious. So it's like an a optional tutorial because, like, where, where I was, it, I was able to just go completely straight and not do this. So, maybe there's not even anything over here that's worthwhile, but we'll find out. 
How do I get to that guy? That's what I want to know. I don't think I can get to him yet. I might have to get to him. Like, this will take me and wrap up around and then get to him. I mean, at the very, at the very least, we're getting a little bit of experience, but I mean, very little. I forget how much these guys dropped, though. Maybe they, he dropped something better. Why did I just get damaged? Is there... Oh, he jumped down. Okay. I was trying to figure out, right as I pulled my sword back, I took damage, and that's why. Okay, they're dropping a little bit more, but still not that much. So I'm not really getting anything that's too worthwhile in here, but hey, it's something. Maybe there's an item at some point. Ah, oh, too far away. Come here. Come here. Woo! Nope. I feel like they might have... I think I said this before, but I feel like they might have actually simplified combat a little bit. And I actually... I like that... Yeah, I did say this before, because I remember talking about how bosses are still kind of like the same difficulty. But I feel like the regular minions, henchmen, are a little bit... um, A little bit easier... Which I feel is kind of nice because it allows you to kind of progress a little bit quicker. Okay, I'm stuck in this tutorial now. But anyways, uh, I feel like we're able to progress a little bit quicker now and not get as uh, overwhelmed by difficult units right off the bat. But the bosses are still just as challenging. Um, two paths. Can I jump and then crawl? Nope, okay, I don't think it's a path actually. Let's take this guy out. I don't think that was really what they were trying to tell me to do, but whatever, it worked. And like I said, at the very least, we're getting a little bit of experience. Okay. What's this take me to? Is there a boss here? There is a boss. Soldier of Godric? Is that him? That looks like just a normal, regular soldier. How did he change angle like that? That's not cool. Oh yeah, this is totally an easy boss. Because I am... I am doing so much damage to him. He was still able to kill me if I, if I didn't do it right, but uh... I, I think I did like a quarter of his health almost on each attack. Okay, well, we kind of came here maybe for nothing, but yeah, because we already wrapped back around here. So yeah, this was just a little tutorial area, so it was kind of a waste-ish. Um, there's still that other one over there, though. I don't know how to get, but whatever. I'm not really worrying about that now. So if I can't go through here, I want to go somewhere else then to try and, and level up a little bit more. Let's just rest really quick. Because I want to get higher level and then go back to that one guy that was absolutely destroying me. Um, I'm curious, actually. The boss up here that killed me the first time? Or was that was that back at the last place? I might have been back at the last place. Like, uh, somewhere before here. I think I started somewhere before this and then I died and came here. I don't remember exactly. Yeah, okay, wait, hold on one second. One of these is where I saw before that somebody said it was a hidden wall, and I don't I don't think it actually is. Whatever. I'm trying to remember when I first started playing, if this is where I was when there was a, um, the first boss that kills you, or if that was before this. Let's go this way. Yeah, I think that was before that, so I don't think I can get back to that area just yet. All right, well, since I'm here, where should I go? What should I do? I could venture down this way. Can I actually make it over to here? Um, nope. Back. Back. Can I actually make it to that area, or is it not uh, traversable? I don't think it's traversable yet. Doesn't look like it, at least. Um, hmm. Okay, where should we go?
I would like to, I would really, really, really like to find golden seeds. I think it's golden seed, something seed. Whatever the seed is, the something seed that I need in order to, uh, actually, you know what, we're gonna fight that, that mount. Whatever seed it is that I need in order to, um, uh, make my flask stronger. I would really like to find that. I just don't, I have no clue where those things are. <coughs> I was kind of hoping maybe it was that, that tree that I was uh, going to, but I don't think it was. How strong is this guy? Oh, no, 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 no. I attacked him and it hardly did any health. Like, really, really close to no health at all, so. I want to I want to get this guy at least. <laughs> but I can't. I am really tempted to just go after that tree sentinel though, but I don't think I should. <laughs> How am I missing so much? All right, let's turn back around. There we go. Some XP, not much, but it's something. Um Okay, where should we go? You know, I said I wanted to go over here, and I never did. So let's go over there. Let's go... Where is it? Let's go there. And then we'll go, uh, like, into this area. Which I said I wanted to, and I just... I haven't done it yet. Excuse me, I had a cough. Um, so let's go over there, and see what we can find. Because I would like to... I'd like to explore and get enough experience to level up some more before I go try and fight that one mini boss again. I don't know if he, like I said, I don't know if he's actually a mini boss, but that's what it feels like to me, so that's what I'm calling it. It's not a, not a side boss, not an optional boss, but like a mini one. Woo! Woo! I don't know how I, I lucked out and didn't get hit by any of those, but... Got him. What do these guys drop? Anything? I keep getting like people dropping bolts, but not arrows. I would love if somebody just started dropping like regular arrows. I mean, I can build arrows now, luckily, so that helps. But it would be really nice if somebody started dropping some. <laughs> I think I've found like a couple maybe, but not much. Mushroom. I don't know what the mushroom's for, but uh, I'm going to take it. What's up in here? Is anything up in here, or is it just these? I don't think this goes anywhere. Let's go back this way, because I don't know where this goes, and I want to find out. Is that a bat? It looks like a bat hanging. Pretty sure it is, actually. Where does this go? Oh, this is kind of a cool setting. What's over here? Honestly, like, if this game didn't even have, like, a story or a quest or anything, like, just here's the world and have fun, I'd be fine with that even. I mean, Breath of the Wild, I don't know how many times I've spent... Oh! I accidentally pressed the wrong button. I don't know how much time I've spent in Breath of the Wild just exploring. Oh, is there a castle over there? It looks like a little mini castle. But yeah, I don't know how much time I've spent in Breath of the Wild just exploring and just having fun and seeing what I can find in the world and... I get a really similar vibe from this game. I think I will probably be able to spend countless hours just exploring. Are you friendly? Yeah, he looks he looks like a friendly guy. You, please, I can read them. Your fingers, please, your fingers. Show hand, yeah, sure. Grand lift. 
Oh, but the bridge is collapsed and cannot be crossed. Only... Why should that matter? Stormvale Castle still stands tall? Okay, um... I don't know what any of that meant, but I'm guessing that means that I can't cross this bridge because she said the bridge is collapsed. <laughs> oh, there's something at the end of it though. Probably just like a, a gold rune or something, but I'm, I'm already here, so I might as well go see what it is. Hey, yo, bro, what you got? You got something? Oh, wait, no, I think this goes somewhere. I'll go explore that. Nomadic's Warrior Cookbook 7. All right, uh, let's go see where this takes us. Hopefully, somewhere. Yeah, I don't think I can go back now, so it's got to take us somewhere. I hear sort of some sort of like chiming sound. Oh, yep. I knew I heard one of them. And there's that over there. I want to kill this guy again to see. I, I don't think he dropped any runes. I think it was just for the flask, but I'm curious, so... Let's try and kill him again. I really just want to know for future reference if he drops runes or not. Because if he does, then he's worth killing. Oh, I got that from him. I don't think that's what the other one dropped. So maybe it's different for each one? Or maybe that is what the other one dropped and I just didn't realize it. Uh, let's get rid of that and leave the sword out. Yep. No, I want the I want the sword. Give me the sword. There we go. Okay, so now how do I get out of here? There's gotta be some way out of this place. Do I? Oh wait, do I have to drop down? Is there somewhere? No, I don't think there's anywhere even to go. Maybe. No, I don't think there's anywhere to go. Okay, so it's gotta be up here somewhere. Feels like this. It looks like these are all like parts of like the castle wall that maybe like collapsed down or something. Um, is there are two ways to go, or is this uh, nowhere? Yep, this takes me nowhere. So I think this is the way we gotta go. Wrong button. Things are getting dark and gloomy. I haven't seen any enemies in a while, which makes me a little cautious that all of a sudden something's going to be jumping out. It also kind of like uh, reaffirms what I said, I think, in the first... Somebody whistle? Kind of reaffirms what I said, in I, th I think, in the first episode, though. Like, I felt like going into this, just the beginning of playing... Oh, it's just him making that sound. Just when I started playing, I kind of had the feeling that there's going to be a lot less encounters than other souls games but when you had them they would be a little bit more interesting and so far that's kind of held true there's not an encounter every five seconds but when you do get them they feel a little bit more interesting and a little bit more impactful which i like where am i going where is this taking me it's taking me somewhere so we're gonna keep going where am i on the map i'm all the way up here okay well let's just keep going I don't think I can go back the other way, so... Your big brothers that have talons on their feet, or on their talons, or sorry, swords on their talons, is what I should say. They're evil. They're awesome, but they're evil. Oh, I thought that was like a, a wolf or something. Like I just stumbled upon a wolf at first. This feels like a really secret path. Speaking of wolves... Boom, bada boom, boom, boom. Those were easy. The wolves actually really aren't that hard in this game, although I should probably heal. Wrong, but wrong thing. Wolves actually really aren't that hard in this game. Um, sorry, I had to mute the the mic so I could cough really quick. But um, 
if you don't pay attention, because there is like three, four, or five of them, if you don't pay attention, they just take you out altogether. But uh, they don't have that much health. So if you get one, maybe two hits on them, they're gone. Oh, that was a bad attack. See, that's what I was talking about. <laughs> if you don't pay attention, they can do damage. But they don't have that much health. I really need to get more health. Speaking of health, I need to upgrade my flask. If anybody's watching this... Actually, no, don't tell me. I was going to say, if anybody's watching this and they know how to up get the seeds, tell me. But actually, no, don't tell me. I want to figure it out. I just hope I haven't gone right like right past them already and totally missed it, which is very possible. But does this go somewhere? Nope. Okay. I think, now that I'm thinking about it too, I think actually Golden Seeds is one of the starting options. I think it's Golden Seed. It's one of the starting options that you can get when you create your character. But, oh well. This is cool. This is a cool scenery. Ooh! Random how it just shifted out of nowhere like that, but this looks gorgeous. Um, this is going to be... Uh, a thumbnail but I need to get rid of my bow because I don't want anything other than my sword so let's remove this oh my god look at this like guys this game is just absolute pure magic if if you don't own the game yourself and you're only watching videos of it online the YouTube compression butchers this game it does not do it justice because this game is absolutely gorgeous oh hello nice little god rays i wonder what's over here where am i now i am i'm in an area that i don't even have the map for yet so i wonder if this means maybe i shouldn't be in this area but i mean i'm here so let's see what we can find I'm just afraid of like coming across. Oh, there's a grace site of grace. I think I, I'm just afraid I, I come across some guy that's absolutely like 400 times higher level than me. <laughs> um, how many how many runes do I have? Can I level? I have 16. I need 30, almost 34. How much do I have in uh, gold runes? Mm. You know, let's use this one. I, I want to know how much this big one is. So let's go ahead and use this really quick. Probably, uh, okay, I was going to say maybe a thousand, but 800. Okay, so I think I got enough if I use just a couple more. I need 3,400. I think these are 200 if I remember correctly, I think. I think they're 200 each. Oh, I need one more. And now I can I can do one more level. Um, what should we do? Dex, get my damage up just a little bit higher, probably. Yeah, I think we should probably go Dex. Get my damage up one higher. If I do this, resistance fire goes up a little bit, health goes up, but. I really need to put out a little bit more damage. I think that was like one of the main things of holding me back on that one uh, mini boss. That and like I was just not doing good when I was doing that yesterday. <laughs> that was definitely part of it. But um, I, I needed to put out a little bit more damage on him. When I was attacking him, it just felt like it wasn't really doing much. And I'm wondering, because I don't have this area on my map, if if I'm too low level for it, if I can't actually do anything here or if I just don't have the map for it yet and I got to find that somewhere because here where I'm at is just gray this is telling me to go this way there's something over there it looks like so I'm either too low level for it I I'm not able to do anything for it or there is a map and I just haven't found it yet and that's all it is let's see how strong this guy is Okay, so he has more health 
than the other ones, but not like an insane amount more. Is he re resurrecting? Oh, he resurrects. Do I have to kill him multiple times? Or does he I think he just keeps resurrecting, yeah. Okay, so let's just get whatever this thing is over here, and then we'll leave. Academy Squirrel. Alright. So, I do not want to fight these guys yet, because I can't kill them. I'm sure I can eventually, but right now I am not able to kill them. Um, hmm. Let's see what's in here. Oh, skull. Hello, skull. I like these little random skulls that you find around the world, just kind of nice. It's like, hey, here's some, here's, you want some, want some free money? Here you go. Okay. What is this? Sacred tear. Oh, wait, I think that's what I need, right? No, it's a seed, I think. Fuck. Uh, I don't remember. Ah, now I'm curious. That might be that. I don't remember. You're tarnished, aren't you? Then perhaps you could spare some rooms. Believe it or not, I studied Flintstone sorceries at the Academy of Rhea Lucaria. For a small donation, I'd be happy to share my knowledge. Uh, don't Yeah, sure. Ten runs, not that much. Bless you. Bless you. You're a true saint. My name is Tobes. Presuming you're interested, I can teach you sorceries as promised. Only none of them are particularly great. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, I don't think... I mean, I can't do sorceries, so it's not really going to be helpful to me. But let's talk to him. Let's see what else he says. Jeez, friend. I'm afraid my meager sorceries are no match for your generosity. Oh, right. I can tell you what I know about this place. That should help a bit. You've seen that structure to the north, towering over the water. That's the Academy of Rhea Lucaria, where we study glintstone sorceries. Only its doors have been closed for quite some time now. After they declared they wouldn't interfere with the shattering, the Academy cast repelling seals on the east gate leading to the capital, and the south gate leading here. As you might have guessed, the seals are still active, making entry to the Academy impossible without a glintstone key. And so I'm stuck here. A fledgling sorcerer with little chance of acquiring a key. When they cast the seals, I'd just popped out. And now I'm uprooted from my place of learning. Okay, uh, what about this? Why not find yourself a glintstone key? Without one, you can't pass through the academy, and you'll never reach the Erdtree capital. And if you find an extra glintstone key, once you've tied up all your loose, would you consider... I know it. Okay, still... I don't need any more of this info. Okay, so... I'm kind of getting the impression that I can't do anything more here. Um, I think I need that key in order to progress. Can I, can I climb this? Why isn't it allowing me to jump? There we go. Um... I'm getting the impression that I can't really do too much more in this area, so maybe I should head back to where I was before. I'm gonna explore for like a, another minute, but that's about it. Is that the academy? Is that the one he was talking about? He said the one over the water. Uh, that that's giving me massive like uh, Winterhelm vibes, or I think it's Winterhelm if I remember correctly from a uh, or Windhelm from a uh, Skyrim. I haven't played Skyrim in years, but the 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 academy that's on that little spire off to the edge of the, the continent. It's kind of reminded me of that. I think it's Windhelm, actually. Whatever it is, you probably know which one I'm talking about. If you're familiar with, or if you're watching this game, you're probably familiar with Skyrim. Even though they're different, they're, uh, it's a similar feeling, similar type of game. People that play this probably play that, and vice versa. Okay. Here's these guys that don't die. Ooh, he's got a lot of health too. Nope, I'm just out. Yeah, this area is uh is not friendly for somebody like me yet. So I think I'm gonna just leave. I'm actually gonna teleport away, but I want to get a little bit further because I think when I pause or when I open up the menu, it doesn't actually pause the game. Okay, so let's go. 
Let's go, um, no, not, not go home. Let's go... I don't really know where to go right now. Hmm. How about we go back? I want to check something here again. Excuse me. I, I if I'm talking a little bit less today than normal because my cough is kind of acting up and uh, I keep muting the microphone when I need a cough. So apologize if I'm coughing or if I'm talking a little bit less than normal. Oh. Oh my God. Yes. 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 I wanted to come talk to her again because she said once I get to the castle, I need to talk to somebody and I haven't talked to them yet, but I just had gotten to the castle, so I was curious. Uh, so can I upgrade it here? Wait, now where's she at though? I'm curious where she's at now. Increase sacred. Oh, it is a sacred tier. So it is that other thing that I picked up, not this thing, but whatever. I just picked one up. Oh, yes. Oh, Golden Sealed is for how many I need. Okay, got it. I'm still going to do that because I just got another one. So I should have... Yep, all right, I got six now. I, I'm not really using my uh, my special ability too much. Maybe I should. Maybe I should get better at using it. But currently, I'm not really using it that much. So I'm not too worried. Um, okay, where should we go? I haven't gone... Have I gone this way? You, oh, no, here's that, that castle I was curious of. I want to go over there, but I'd rather do it at daytime because this area is so dark and gloomy, it's kind of hard to see to begin with. So I'd rather do this area during daytime just so I can see a little bit better. So so wait until morning, and then we're going to venture over to that, like, that, that half structure that was on the map that I was looking at a few minutes ago. Uh, ooh, that's really cool looking. Oh, there's a big guy, too. Maybe we should fight him. Yeah, I just kind of wanted to see what was over at that area, though. How many arrows do I have right now? Do I need to make arrows? Wait, what is this? Rainbow stone arrow? Rune fragment. I don't know if I want to use a rune fragment on this, though. So we're just going to do regular more bone arrows. Uh, actually, no, let's do more. Okay, so now equipment... Bone arrow. Baron arrow fletched. Um, yeah, we'll we'll leave the fletched ones on. I have less of them, but we'll leave those ones on for now. I want to see if I can maybe fight this guy. This looks awesome right now. It actually probably looks really terrible after the compression. I apologize because it's it's got kind of a blurry look to begin with right now, and the compression is probably just making it that much more. So I apologize if it doesn't look great for you guys, but for me, it looks epic. This is just epic looking. Like, yeah, okay, I think this might actually be a thumbnail as well. Wait, no, here, hold on. One hand, wait for everything to disappear. Come on, there we go. This is probably going to be a thumbnail as well. Alright, let's go see if we can fight this guy. And then maybe see what that is as well. I'm not worried about him. I wonder if I could fight him on my horse. You know what? Actually, I want to use the other arrows. Because I think I'm actually going to use a lot of arrows on this guy. Or at least I'm going to try to. And yeah, I just think I'm better off using these ones. Wait, did he see me? I'm curious though, actually. Really quick, do this quick. Yeah, there we go, I can do that, okay. So, the other arrows should be there now? Yes, they are, cool, okay. Not really doing that much damage, but it's something, so. I want to get better at using my bow, so I figured this would be a good chance to use my bow and maybe have fun as well. 
Does it matter which leg I shoot? Like if I if I just attack one, will he go down quicker, maybe? I don't know if it matters, but it might. Come on, bro. Come on. Doesn't seem like the fletched arrows really do that much more damage. Maybe a few points, but not anything really noticeable. Which I don't think they even do a few points. Oh, I didn't need to dodge that. So many arrows in that poor dude's knee. I don't know how that didn't hit me, actually. I, th I feel like that should have hit me, but I'm okay that it didn't. If I can take this guy out with just my bow, I'll be happy. Oh, there we go. This might be damaging. Seems like the fletched arrow makes a different sound as well, but that's really the only difference I'm noticing with the fletched arrow. I, I'm sure there has to be a difference though. I can't imagine that it's pointless. Ah, okay, I need to heal. Heal, 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 heal. I really just want to take him out with just my, I don't know if I have enough arrows, but if I do, I want to take him out with just my bow. I never really used bows in Dark Souls either, so this is kind of like a weird change for me, but I'm enjoying it. I didn't really like the way the bows worked in Dark Souls. They feel different and better to me now. And I know I could probably have taken them out already if I'm using my sword. Oh, I am out of regular. I just needed one more. I was going to say, I know I probably could have taken them out easier and quicker if I used my sword, but I just wanted to try just my bow. Okay, I'm happy with that. I didn't get a lot of experience or anything, but still, just the fact that I was able to take him out with just my bow, I'm happy with that. Although, I, I kind of need some more arrows. <laughs> I don't really have any arrows now. I have like a couple fletched ones, and then I have these ones, but I don't know what these are. Damage goes down a little bit. Causes sleep build. Up. Ooh, that's actually kind of nice. So how about we do this? Over here... We'll do these ones. And then over here, we'll do this one. I don't know. It's sleep build up. So I'm guessing I probably have to do it multiple times. I don't know who I would be attacking that I would shoot with an arrow multiple times and then put him asleep, but who knows? Let's see what's over here. I feel like this is I feel like this is going somewhere. This is obviously like a ledge that's put here that I can I can traverse. Is it just a random ledge? Is it pointless? Maybe it's a pointless random ledge. Okay. All right, well, let's, let's continue down this way and see what's over here. I could have used their bones, but whatever. Oh, 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 what's this? The way it's sitting in this kind of looks a little worrisome strength not okay i don't know what this is for but um i'll take it i'll, I'll definitely take it oh it looks like i can climb down this way all right let's go back let's go back down because this looks like nothing over there oh oh i might have messed up Oh, whew, okay. Now where? Do I go this way? Or do I go this way? I think this is the better way. It's still kind of a drop though. Okay, I'm all right. Was this intended to be like a way to, to come down? It kind of feels like maybe it was, but anything under here? No, it doesn't look like it. Yo, I think you have bones, right? Come here, boar. Come here, boar. No, not you. Do I have to shoot you in order to... Uh, 
Ah, and I miss, and I got one arrow left. No, I'm just gonna leave him. What is this? Oh, I think I see a fire over here. Alright, cool. And there's a guy over here. Okay, this might be something interesting. Let's let's see what's here. And I'm curious that 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 strength not tier that I got. I think that's what it was called. Can can I use this for? Use two golden seeds to increase. Okay. Use the sacred tier. No. Okay. Use two golden seeds, yes. No, not enough. Okay, okay. I don't think I can do anything with that um, strength not tier here. M maybe back at my hold, maybe? You. Who are you? What are you? What do you want? Not seen you before. Name's Bernard. Tarnished, just like you. Let me ask you something. Are you here in the lands between to take up the fight? Does your faith in the guidance of grace hold firm? Despite the collapse of the Golden Order. Uh, yeah, sure. Yes, you're a tarnished through and through. Takes me back. That's a quality needed now more than ever. Any interest in bearing the torch of my battle arts? All I know is the sword. Picked up a fair few tricks in my time, too. Now's the time to pass them on. To a good and proper tarnished like you. Okay, so if this is... Oh, okay, never mind. I thought this... Do I have to, like, pledge allegiance to him or something? Excuse me, I had a cough. Uh, I'm coughing a lot today. Anyways, um... I haven't seen anything like it yet, but in... In Dark Souls games, sometimes if you, like... Pledge allegiance to somebody, you lose something else. And I thought maybe this was that, but no, it doesn't really look like that. Masters of War Kick... Okay, it's these things. Now, do I have to put these on my sword, or can I use them indiv individually? Uh, like, this would just be nice to have just by itself. Just like a general kick. 800. I have 1,000. Um, no skill. Use. Usable on shields and torches. Grants. I am kind of curious about this, so I'm going to just take this. I don't think I can equip it here, but... of all the warriors who raised their arms in battle lost and died a fine tale all told of true chivalric romance that's how I fell in love with the sword and the arts of combat it grants meaning even to falling in battle to death itself okay so there's no more conversing with him I wonder if he's going to stay here or if he'll go to the hold as well what was that? Oh, it was just a herb. Herba. Sorry. Herba. Not a herb. A herba. What else is in this area? Is there anything over here? This this forest has a really cool visual aesthetic to it. Ooh, another big boy. I didn't really get that much um, souls from him, though, or, or runes, so I don't know if it's really... Mm. Two big boys, but there's that. I don't know what that is, but it might be something worthwhile. But I was going to say, just the... Three big boys, and he it looks like there's something at his feet as well. Is this like where they breed or something? Anyways, uh, monetarily speaking, I don't think it was really worth it to fight him. As fun as it was, I don't think it was necessarily monetarily worth it, so I don't know if I should bother fighting three of them, because that, be, uh, that might be a challenge to fight three of them, and not really worth it from a, a monetary standpoint. I don't know if these are four, but there's a there's like a flock of them right here, so I'm gonna take it. You know, I haven't I haven't tested my I think I should be able to do it right now. Then I can just go back and rest. So Yes! Okay, so that's how it works. So I did just need um that little icon over on the left side to show up and then they're gone. Maybe they need to have like somebody to attack and if they don't have anyone to attack they just disappear. But 
You know, I think this actually might be a good spot to wrap up this episode. I'm trying to keep these under an hour, and I keep failing at that. And uh, didn't get too much done in this one, but I did explore a little bit. I did uh, upgrade my my flasks a little bit more. I found this guy. I took on a big boy with just the arrows, and I, I felt really good about that. I think this is going to be a good spot to wrap up this episode. And then next episode, we're going to venture over to here, because I really want to know what's over in this castle. I want to level up one or two more times before, before I go try and fight that boss again. Which you see my uh, my runes are still there sitting for me. Don't know if I'll die before I get back to them, but we'll see. But yeah, I think this is going to be a good spot for me to wrap it up. So if you're enjoying this, please like, subscribe. Um, I'm going to probably, do, if people are enjoying these videos, I'm probably going to be doing the entire uh, game record the whole thing, make a series out of it, however many episodes it is. So if you enjoy this, please let me know. Like, subscribe, comment, saying, hey, you suck, or hey, I like it, or whatever. Just say something, or just say hello. Or, you know what? If you watch these videos, you probably know why I'm saying this, but say meow. And, uh, yeah, I'll catch y'all later. Peace.